Hello, in this video I am going to look at the STD in feature. So this is the standard in, standard in, standard in functionality. So we'll be using this in conjunction with fget. If you don't know what that is, feel free to check out my fget video that's already uploaded. And STD in is basically an extension on that. What that allows you to do is get standard input input from the console and we'll combine it with f get. Okay, so we'll be getting string instead of from a file, but we'll be getting it from a console this time or the terminal. Okay, so we all need a hashtag include stdio.h. Then we'll need a chart string 256. Then we'll need a f printf and we're literally going to say, please enter a long string. And now we just put f gets. I'm going to put the string array that we created 256. So that's a maximum of 256 characters, comma std in. That's all you put. You don't have to put anything else to read data from the console and put it into you know using f gets semicolon and we're gonna put printf put sentence comma string and give that a run see what we get okay so we're getting some error and we're getting some error here in the f print f Ah, sorry, it wasn't meant to be fprintf, it was meant to be printf. fprintf is for files. Save that, and let me rerun it. Here we go, please enter along. Uh, let me just save that again, rerun it. There we go. Okay, so if I say, hello, my name is for hard to say, and I click enter. Hello, my name is Farhan Hussain. That's it. That's how you use the STD in, standard in functionality, in conjunction with FGET. If you have any questions, it's pretty simple stuff, but if you do, feel free to join the Discord group. There's a link in the description. There's almost 4,000 members, usually about 300 or so members online at any given time, and there's a bunch of programming channels. So I look forward to seeing you in there. Bye-bye.